गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स आई विद्यासागर योर एस एस टीचर वेलकम यू ऑल इन द ई लर्निंग क्लास ऑफ मॉडर्न इंटरनेशनल स्कूल हिस्सा आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट सब्जेक्ट हिस्ट्री ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड एट एंड दिस इज माई वीडियो लेक्चर फाइव ऑन दिस टॉपिक नाउ योर चैप्टर इज हाउ वेन एंड वेयर वेयर आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट द टॉपिक एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन प्रोड्यूज रिकॉर्ड्स Dear students, as we have discussed about the colonial is yesterday, and uh, we have discussed about the colonials that are stronger country who having the influence over a weaker country in all around it in all aspects. You can say the social as well as the other aspects. Now we are going to discuss about the their records, their administrative ideas. their how their uh, well settled administrative ideas were there dear students as we know that these british they were very intelligent and they were very uh, you can say uh, they were a, uh, keeping the records it means what the things was happen they were keeping it in a very systematic way as during their administration as about their administration we could know about only about the sources which have been found and which have been preserved by them <clears throat> as the british they were took it as very important the art of the writings and the each and every instruction plan policy was agreement investigation was very clearly written because they were interested that uh, we have to keep it in the written records because so that it could be used further or it could be seen later that whenever anyone required it like and uh, the british who were also keeping these documents very carefully because they used to think it that whenever we it will required it could be used and so they have set up the records rooms for the tahsildars who were in the village to record the taxes and the collectors the commissioners and all where the provincial offices they kept the record room where the uh, important documents could be preserved even the letter and the memos who have been introduced by the british it all was kept in those record room you can see the districts official which have been prepared in this same page you will see in the right side that the source is given here how it was kept very carefully and nowadays after 200 uh, after 200 years ago we can go through these sources as in the right side some of the incidents which have been happened at that time and the things which was written that record we can see as a source in the right side of the page page number 5 now during the 19th century we can see that uh, <clears throat> these documents which were preserved as it was written also were calif carefully and these writing methods was known as calligraphy it means calligraphy was the method by which any of the writing was written very clearly and it was designed very beautifully now whenever the printing press as you know the printing press was invented by the gutenberg so the printing press whenever it was spreaded the newspapers the printings and multiples copies of these records were printed and each of the government was preceded it it means the it was passed to the other government which were using these records and they were following the same method next your topic is survey became important do you know the survey you have heard 
about the survey survey it means surveyction the survey was the very important part of the british officials as they used to consider that we cannot rule over any particular country until we did not survey it well about the boundaries about the village about the all geographical areas as those british they were entitled and they were doing the surveys like uh, for the village uh, revenues they also survey for the topography topography it means the features of the different landscape it was also mentioned in their surveys like the survey for the soil the flora and the fauna flora fauna it means vegetation and the animals these all things were surveyed it means which kind of uh, vegetation which kind of animals which kind of product can be grown in a particular area it means these all surveys they have made it and they have planned it very carefully because they have already told that if you want to rule at any place we have to know it about well and like the cropping pattern of the different places different soil on the different soil it was also mentioned there and at the end of the 19th century census it means the counting of the population by every 10 years it was also started there as their different regions their occupations and different things was also mentioned in this survey records they have also survey about the botanical about the geological survey archaeological survey and anthropological survey as well as the forest surveys so dear students can we think about it that how much surveys it was done too much years ago at means the before the during the, the british era these surveys was taken place it means how much they were curious about the indian subcontinent and how the indian subcontinent was rich in all aspects now your next is what official record do not tells yes as we know these official records must be written by any scholar and these scholar must be write these records in a such way that it could be only praised about the british not was in such way that what were the disparity or what were the dissimilarity which have been spreaded by them this was only that everything was good and everything was fine but uh, as the historians they have they were interested and they have shown us that uh, how the different aspect was also there as you can see that uh, the how the peoples and uh, what kind of situation was there like when we have begin to search then uh, sources we find in plenty through as more difficulty to go get than the official records it means the official record did not show us the real incidents what ha actually had been happened at that times because it was it only show us that how important and how well the administrative services which have which was maintained during their own time but as we will see the peoples and their diaries will see the accounts of pilgrims travelers autobiographies and the important personalities popular booklets they were sold in the local bazaars as the printing newspaper were aspli published and issue were debates in publics leader and reformers wrote spread their ideas poet and novelist wrote to express their feelings as these written records these media have helped us a lot to know about the earlier situation because we can only knew it by the written records we don't have any um, such 
incidents we don't have any such uh, circumstances through which we can knew it but the written records which is the only sources as well as the monuments as well as the pilgrims these are the only sources through which we can know about the earlier times but can these records tell us about what was the life of the peasants what was the life of the peoples at that times and what were the socio and economic condition at that time and how they were helpless to live a meager life it means they have no any freedom and they have no any uh, and all type of respect and which was imposed to them okay we will discuss in the next chapter how the uh, different situation was there during the british time in the colonial india okay dear students read the paragraph and watch the video carefully thank you